What's up, my people? This is Showbiz the Adult. All right, man, look. Wilder versus Ortiz, the rematch, is going to be on pay-per-view. Showtime. Hold up, coffee. When I heard it was going to be on pay-per-view. <laughs> Coffee. This is a Starbucks toffee. Uh, black, one sugar, just one sugar because it's already toffee flavored. Delicious. Delicious. All right, man, look. I'm, going, I'm not going to even rag on the pay-per-view yet. I'm just going to, to bring up to you guys. Where we could have been as far as the heavyweight division and where we are now. Let's talk about the potential, where we could have been, things that were actually being discussed and where we are now. Where we were. Fury versus Wilder 2, April, the rematch, April. That's where we were. We were going to have that fight in April. Then Anthony Joshua came to the States. Anthony Joshua, Big Baby Miller, June. Tyson Fury, Deontay Wilder, rematch April, June. Big Baby Miller against Anthony Joshua. Brazil, mandatory against Deontay Wilder. But on the zone for eight, now if whatever, I got the year subscription. So it would have been $8.99 a month for me. I wouldn't have to pay 80, 90 bucks on the zone, Brazil, right? We had it free on Showtime, but I'm just saying this is where we were. Why on the zone against Brazil? Because we would have had Anthony Joshua against Deontay Wilder. Then Anthony Joshua again against Deontay Wilder. This is where we were. April, Deontay Wilder versus Tyson Fury rematch. Big Baby Miller Anthony Joshua June. Wilder versus Brazil on the zone. Then Wilder versus Anthony Joshua the zone. Then the rematch. Wilder versus Anthony Joshua the zone. That's where we were. Let me tell you where we are. Deontay Wilder versus Ortiz. Rematch. Pay per view. Anthony Joshua against Andy Ruiz. Um, and Tyson Fury against Schwartz. May the Schwartz be with you. That's where we are. Deontay Wilder against Ortiz, the rematch <laughs> on pay-per-view. Anthony Joshua against Ruiz on the zone. Tyson Fury against Schwartz. That's where we are. How did we get there? How did we get there? Deontay Wilder was right there about to fight Tyson Fury. Tyson Fury signed the top rank. He ducked for the Bucks. He bounced, got Schwartz. Deontay Wilder left without a fight. Anthony Joshua got Big Baby Miller. Pop, pop. PD, pissing dirty. He got uh, I don't know, HGH, uh, uh, what else? He, the the GW, whatever he had, 15, 16, all that stuff. Pop dirty. Andy Ruiz, his replacement. Instead of Ortiz, it was gonna be Ortiz, but Ortiz, according to him, he didn't know. He didn't know that it was gonna be a seven million dollar offer. He didn't know, so they refused it. Now we know in hindsight that Ortiz and them, their team already promised the PBC Al Heyman, always, they are, they're all together, they're on the bed together. He already promised Al Heyman that he was gonna fight Deontay Wilder after Brazil. That's where we are. Now Brazil, Brazil ended up uh, fighting, I mean Deontay Wilder ended up fighting Brazil on Showtime instead of the zone having a package deal with Anthony Joshua. Why? He refused the package deal. Instead of having $20 million against Brazil, $40 million against Anthony Joshua, another $40 million against Anthony Joshua, this guy decided to take, what, 10 to $12 million against Brazil and uh, now he's taking Ortiz to pay-per-view so he can try to get some of that money back. That's where we are. The heavyweight division is becoming a laughing stock. 
is becoming a laughing stock. Okay? Too bad because there's so much potential. Now, Anthony Joshua, out of all of this, he's going to look pretty good. Okay? Let me tell you why. Um, Dillian White, there's talks of him fighting Tyson Fury for the WBC Diamond title to be the mandatory for Deontay Wilder. That may happen. But I think Dillian White, I don't think that fight is going to happen. I think Tyson Fury and Deontay Wilder is going to fight without Dillian White. That's what I personally think. How Anthony Joshua is going to look okay is because Anthony Joshua probably is going to get that Usyk fight before the rest of them, okay? With Anthony Joshua fighting Usyk, that's one hell of a fight. That's a great fight for the fans, okay? Um, then Anthony Joshua, he may get that rematch with Dillian White at that point because Deontay Wilder ain't fighting him. Who's going to be left, okay? Tyson Fury and Deontay Wilder are going to be fighting each other. At the end of the day, they're going to come out okay, all right? Um, but what I'm looking forward to, to be honest, is the F.A. of Jog Bays, Daniel Dubois, um, the O6, um, you know, stuff for Joe Joyce, uh, stuff like that. I'm looking forward to that now because the heavyweight division right now is just a laughing stock. Where we were and where we are now, miles apart. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Uh, am I for this is and this is exactly why I'm for the zone. This is exactly why uh, I love the zone because I'm paying eight ninety nine a month, something around there, eight nine dollars, something like that a month. I forget. I didn't do the math because I paid the hundred dollars for the year, um, and I get just get the fights without having to. Because I'm going to pay for the pay per view fight. I'm going to buy the pay per view fight, Deontay Wilder against Ortiz too, because that's my job. Okay, so you guys rely to rely on me. You come to my channel to watch my live commentary for the fights. So I'm getting them all. So I'm going to buy that fight. I'm just saying for the fans, for everybody else to have to shell out that money, that's ridiculous for that fight. That's ridiculous, okay? But that's why I love the zone because I don't get blindsided by stuff like that. Any fight that's on the zone, I'm like, man, I get to watch it. Bet. I'm out. Shh. Huh.